Yes guys, welcome to today's video on my extremely large YouTube. I think this is going out on my YouTube, it's also going out on Gorilla Wares as well. And today we're going to go and shoot Gorilla Wares new hybrid line. So I've got the uh, quarter zip on here and the track is very nice, very nice material. Very nice fit as well. Uh, so we're going to go to one of the locations that I've used before. I've only used this location like twice, but I kind of like it. If you're from Leeds, you're probably going to know where it is. Um, but I just kind of like the building in the back, and I like the backdrops. So we're going to go there. We're going to meet my photographer there. We're going to shoot a few shots um, so I can put this on social. Um, and then I'm going to go back to mine. I'm going to get some food. I need to wash my car as well because my car is absolutely filthy. Um, I kind of like to wash it every week. Um, so, yeah. I'm gonna go shoot food, go wash my car, and then we're gonna go train. All right. I have nothing but issues with this fucking car, like. Yeah, nice one. That's definitely, we're definitely got a BMW to kick off. <laughs> That's fucking minging in it. What the fuck? Anyone knows how to fix this, just put it in the comments below. I must have to get a new one because that's fucking shit in it. Look at that, oh my god, that's shocking that. Sand. Socks back on. It's mingling when you got no socks on, isn't it? Right, yeah, so got, that was like really quick, guys, because I only had to shoot like really one outfit. Didn't take that long. Normally, when I'm on shoots, I have about 20 things to shoot. Oh, fuck. You know what I mean, so grill the wear, I also have supplements to shoot as well. Um, but yeah, normally shoots take a bit longer than that, probably around. Now sometimes depends how many locations you use as well. Obviously in winter, I kind of just use one location. But when it gets to like summer, I'll go to like three in a day, two, three in a day, um, just because the weather's nice and we can get better backdrops. And winter's fucking cold, man. Do you know what I mean? So we didn't exactly want to be standing outside all day. So I mean, it is nine degrees today, which is actually all right. Compared to what it was like last week or the week before, it was like three, four degrees. And we were shooting in that and I was like, wow, this is cold. Um, but yeah, nine degrees is all right, it was a bit of a wind chill today. So I was just like, actually, it's actually quite cold today. Um, but I've heard we're getting up to the heights of 17 degrees at the weekend. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 
short weather top off. All right, guys, what we're going to do now? He's going to go back to mine. I'm going to get some food. Um, then I'm going to clean my car. And then I'm actually going to take it to BMW because it's really annoying me, that thing. Uh, it needs fixing. But I bet money I go there and they go, oh, yeah, we don't have it in. Oh, yeah, you're going to have to leave it for us. For us. You're going to have to leave the car with us for about four days and then uh, you can have it back. Do you know what I mean? That's what they normally do. So, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do now. Hi mate, um, I had my BMW with you, I think it was about, maybe about three, four weeks ago. Um, but I've just noticed another problem with um, my back door, one of the rubber grips is coming off now. It's a bit of a joke, this, this BMW is costing me a fortune to be fair. Today's not an option is it? Would you have to give me a courtesy or not? We're looking two months and then it's available to Casey Keller. Yeah, no problem mate. Cheers, thank you mate. Thank you. Cheers mate, bye bye. bye, -bye. Right guys, we're going to eat. This is a typical meal of what I eat right now. Rice. Alright. Just microwave, two mins. It's not much. Looking at about 30 grams of carb, just in that. Um, and then I always have some mackerel for this in the spicy tomato sauce because that's the fucking best one. I like a bit of fish at the moment. I like fish, like mackerel, tuna. I do like salmon, but salmon is quite expensive sometimes. Um, that's like a typical post-workout meal where it is with the white rice. Bodybuilding meal, get those healthy fats in. What are you thinking? That looks absolutely fucking gipping. This is like the easiest meal to eat. Don't take long, it literally takes about, well, what, a minute to make. Alright. Which makes it so simple and so easy, especially if you're in a rush. If you don't like mackerel, then you're fucked really, aren't you? <sighs> yeah, I'm reading dot com secrets. I've got like three other books in there as well. I'm about a quarter way through that right now. Because um, I'm just learning more about like click funnels and stuff like that. Russell Bronson is one of the best. Russell Bronson. So, I've got another book of his in there as well. It's like website hacks. But that, 
I'm also reading Rich Dad Poor Dad, which I should have should have read that ages ago, but I just haven't got around to it. So I'm about halfway through that now. As I get older, I like reading. Yeah, because I'm like 30 now, so I actually like make a note in my notepad every day that I must read at least 30 to 40 minutes every day, which is very good to be fair. It's, it's very useful. Right guys, we're at the car wash now. No, I'm just waiting for these people to finish washing the car so I can wash mine. We were actually here the other day. I think it was like minus one or something. I don't know, it was cold. I at least put about nine quid in the machine for it not to work. So uh, it looks like they're all working today, which is uh, a lot better. But yeah, I'm gonna wash this car because it's absolutely filthy. Like I said, I don't think I washed it. I think last time I washed it was like two weeks ago, but we've had some shit weather. So, um, yeah, very dirty at the moment, so just gotta get it washed. Nothing special, just a quick spray, quick soap and spray. Yeah. guys welcome to the gym all right some of you might not have seen this place in a very long time and you're probably not going to see it for another seven weeks and i feel so sorry for you it's hard that i get it i'm an elite athlete though and i get to train you know what i mean so uh, yeah um all i'm going to do is go through an arm workout typical arm routine for me um sometimes i change it up sometimes i don't i've had a kfc twister meal today so um phone's gone off birds and that, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, I've had a KFC twist meal today, pre-workout. Gonna get some nasty KFC pumps, all right? Obviously, I'm all kicked out and give it away. I'm gonna set this off soon though, it's gonna get hot in here. Um, gonna start off with some dumbbells, warm myself up. Probably gonna go into some like drag curls and then we're gonna do some machine work. So triceps, a lot of push downs, a lot of rope work. I love using rope. Obviously, when you use rope, you're gonna use three heads of tricep instead of two, but you get that really really nice squeeze on the rope, I feel. Um, I do some skull crushers, and then again, I'm gonna probably finish off with some machine work, guys. Let's do it. Uh, 
I got options. I can pass that bitch like stockings. Just Josh. We spend this holiday locked in. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top 10. I can put the ball in the end zone. Put a bad bitch in the end zone. This shit sound like an intro jet song. Give me that tip. <sighs> When performing this exercise, make sure you fire your tricep at the bottom, all right, to get full range of movement. And when we come up to the top, we're gonna squeeze at the shoulder. <laughs> Guys, if you want a lot of girls, you need big arms. It doesn't matter if you've got a small dick, all right? Because it can just feel your arms, all right? So it's about remember that one, a key tip, yeah. Come on in there, bitch, I'm huge. You see I'm huge. Come on in. Bing. Nothing, I apologize, I apologize. But fuck me anyway, but feel my arms. You feel how big my arms are, don't you? This is a solid exercise, this lads. Right. If you're into a bit of, to a bit of that, sick exercise. Mind you, extra triceps as well. Not forever, all right? Makes your forearms as well. Come on, I know what you're thinking. Is this guy on fucking steroids? This guy, this guy just got bigger and stronger the older he got. Senator, I was never on steroids. I just got bigger and stronger the older I got. And um, what I normally do is bicep, tricep, bicep, tricep, bicep, tricep. All right, so three exercises on each. Sometimes I do four on each, but today we're gonna do three because the man's got a business called at 6.45, so I need to get back home and that, yeah? And then I've got a bird coming around mine and that. No, no, it's not tonight. That's tomorrow. But you know what I mean? You need to clean the apartment and that first. You know, my bed sheets haven't been changed in like fucking two weeks or something. You know, they need to get changed and that before she comes around and stays the night. Right, guys. Second dumbbell exercise, we're gonna do some hammer curls. You may see these thick grips on here. I don't like thick grips, all right? I've got tiny fucking hands, all right? And it's just shit when it comes to thick grips. All we're gonna do is some hammer curls. I'm only gonna go up to like 17s, 20s, do you know what I mean? Again, I don't go too heavy. I like to feel that activation, all right? And that stimulation is a lot better for me. And um, I feel like I can, build a better physique like that, you know what I mean? Because summer I'm coming, all right? I'm coming. It's all on your dickies when you're on steroids. Oh my God. It make you big and make your dick little, ain't that? Ain't no motherfucking side effect, that's from Satan. What the fuck are you talking about? Rope. Sick exercise for triceps. You know, it's gonna tag all three heads of your tricep. Really push down, squeeze. I tend on this one. I start off quite light. And I'll probably go down to about 24 on this. All right. Um, I'll start quite high with the reps. All right, normally around 12, 15. Then I'll gradually bring them down the heavier I get. All right. <sighs> Alright, yeah, so I think it was my last video. <coughs> Probably see my cleaner in there. My cleaner. Yeah, she was my girlfriend, but um, we sadly parted ways. Um, it was just last Saturday um, where she um, unfortunately went on my phone again. And um, unfortunately, she ruined a fucking day. Um, by going on my phone. Here's what it is, you know what I mean? School boy over there. Don't want a lot of phone in it, you know what I mean? Tip for all you girls out there. Wanna ruin your day? Go on your lad's phone. There you go. You know what I mean? Shit happens. Here's what it is. <sighs> Nearly single again. As always, because birds kinda get in the fucking way, don't they? Yeah, you're getting in the way, especially in lockdown and that, so. Is what it is, you know what I mean? Wish you all the best, but.
just uh, end it there, yeah. Sad. <sighs> Right, you know, JP, in the last video, not the last video, video before, nah, what video was it? I can't remember which video. You know, you might have seen him, he had them horrible gardening trainers on. Yeah. This is JP's favourite machine, not. But it's one of my favourite machines. JP hates this machine, but JP, he's got tiny little pot noodle arms, all right? He ain't got guns like me, all right? Yeah, just like, the, I like the machine-based stuff, anything on a cable, anything where I can get that like, squeeze at the top. Plus, I feel like anything that's cable fed, you're gonna get that tension all the way through. All right? Dumbbells here, I'm gonna do some uh, tricep extensions. Only got some 15. Again, not so heavy, but then my triceps are pretty fatigued. I'm exercise, so we might not get that many. Right, guys, we've done three triceps, done three biceps. I'm actually gonna finish off on biceps. Really, I'll do more on triceps, because obviously, upper part of your arm, it's more tricep muscle than it is bicep muscle, so I feel like you should always do more on your triceps than you should biceps. Um, you know, to get that real solid muscular development. Um, but this is one of my favorite exercises on a Smith machine, It'd be some drag curls. I just feel like it's one of the best exercises for your biceps. Again, I'm not gonna go too heavy. I know you like to think that I'm absolute, an absolute massive unit, because I am a massive unit. And you like to think that I'm, you know, I mean, he's possibly benching like four or five plates aside. You'd be wrong. I'm only benching 100 kg. And I'm only gonna drag curl like five kg aside as well. I've not found five kg. I've found two sets, four sets of one. There we have it guys, just done a little bit of arms. Standard workout for me really. Um, and then I'm gonna obviously go back to mine, have my last meal. Maybe McDonald's or something, you know what I mean? Might have a tub of Ben's or something, I don't know yet. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna uh, go back to mine, sort my night out. Also, comment below what you wanna see. If you want some more relationship, can't speak. If you want some relationship advice, Put it in the comments below. I'll do a video on relationship advice because I'm solid at that. All right, I've got a good track record. All right, I've had a lot of girlfriends. A lot of girlfriends. A lot of sexual partners. Um, but yeah, anything you want to see more working out. I'm going to do some collabs soon as well when we can actually leave the country. I'll go and do some collabs for you. Up. But yeah, if you want any more stuff on business, anything like that, let me know. Right guys, that's it for today's video. Just a load of bullshit again. I'm just trying to bring you, you know, a lot of value on this program. Program, channel. Um, couldn't have fucked that one up, did I? <laughs> Fuck it, cut it the other bit. <laughs> yes guys, so I'm just trying to bring you loads of value on this channel. Um, obviously we're nearly at that 5,000 subscriber rate, all right? We're nearly there, all right? I'm fucking killing YouTube, all right? I'm at the heights, all right? I'm fucking well famous from YouTube now. You know what I mean? You want to see how much fucking money I've made from this channel already. <laughs> fucking hell, it's a lot. Um, but like I said, the goal 
Let's get this extremely large YouTube to 100,000 subscribers before the end of the year, which is more than doable. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna keep blasting out the content for you guys. Um, if you wanna see anything else, I know a lot of you just want me to talk about performance and some drugs, um, such as like Viagra and stuff like that. But um, no, the real performance and some drugs. Yeah, a lot of you want me to cover that. And I will cover that video just a bit later down the line. Um, but yeah, just put in the comments below what you actually wanna see next. And then um, we'll, uh, me and all I'm gonna try and conjure something up and give you it. All right, guys, sweet, peace. Oh yeah, one more thing. Guys, if you watched the previous video, not the previous, the one before that, um, obviously my new business where I actually help personal trainers scale their online business. In the description box below, there is a load of links to testimonials of a few personal trainers that I've helped out. So if you are wanting to come on board, um, please click the link, have a look at them, and then contact me through Instagram saying that you've seen the video on YouTube, blah, blah, blah. Um, and obviously I'll personally get back to you on that. You need to pass a certain criteria for you to actually come on board with the, the course that I'm actually selling. Um, so I can actually you know, help you do what you need to do in the online space, being a personal trainer. Okay guys.